Hey, science lovers, it's Becky with Lab Ride Academy, and check out what I found. I found a tree with snow on it. Normally, when I think of tree and snow, I think that a tree wants to conserve its energy over the winter because there's less sunlight, and so it drops all its leaves. Now, these particular trees do not do this. This is a pine tree, and as you can see, it has snow all over it. Trees that are able to keep their leaves and their needles over the winter are called evergreen. The way that this particular tree is able to survive the winter is by having waxy coating on the outside of these needles. That allows the water on the inside of these ne needles to not freeze. Evergreen trees also hold less water inside of their needles. These needles also have a natural chemical that is an antifreeze with sugar, jasmonic acid, and ethylene that prevents the water from freezing. These natural antifreeze chemicals are what give these trees their distinct to smell. Now I'm sure that you know that trees are made out of cells and cells have a lot of water inside of them and that water can freeze but over the winter there is one more thing that these trees can do to prevent themselves from freezing and that is intentional dehydration because I want to make sure that these cells that keep this tree alive do not get harmed. What it can do is it intentionally dehydrates itself by sucking the water out of its cells and putting it in between the cells so that none of the cells would be harmed, so that they can continue to do photosynthesis over the winter when there is less sunlight. Wow, science is so amazing. I hope you guys have a beautiful day. God bless. Bye-bye.